Hello and welcome once more to Red Gaming Tech for yet more of your daily gaming news and myself, Marta. Today is the 3rd of February and I have some news for you today regarding Pro Evolution Soccer 2015 as Konami Europe boss Shinji Hirano revealed to MCV at the game which is of course currently in development for PlayStation 4 but not yet announced for Xbox One is partly being handled by a British development team for the very first time. And Hirano said, quote, I can't say certain things about PES 2015, but we are ready to make a comeback. I cannot give details on exactly what we are doing with the UK studio, but they are working on the next project and looking at the needs of the European people. It's about globalising the franchise, so it's not just being developed by Japanese people. We know what's been going wrong with PES, we are working on that. The next version is totally changed. 2014 is a transitional year for the franchise, so expect big things. So from the sounds of it to me, they are hoping to get some of the European talent and the UK talent on board, not only to make it more appealing to a European audience, but to perhaps give it that air of authenticity as of course. Football is pretty much a British pastime for a lot of people. Not for myself personally, I'm not really much of a sports person. But obviously football is pretty damn popular here. It's probably mo the most popular sport with cricket and stuff not far behind. So I think it's a good decision for them to get some talent in from the country that basically is very passionate about the sport and can perhaps lend them a few nuggets of wisdom that they may have not realised coming from Japan, which is of course a very different culture to here in the UK. So it seems like they understand that PES has been not quite what people wanted for 2014, so at least they're making headway with some major changes and hopefully the inclusion of the UK team, whatever it is that they're doing, I don't know. Obviously Konami didn't say well, I think it will at least, it's, it's a good sign that it's a positive step in the right direction, I think, personally, that we could be seeing some good changes coming for the series. But I'd be curious to hear some thoughts from veteran PES players. What changes would you like to see them bring to the table? And what do you think the inclusion of a UK-based team being you know, in, involved in the development could actually bring to the game? And do you think it'll actually make a difference or is it all just smoke and mirrors? Anyway, that is me done for this video. Hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.